What's up, YouTube? It's Maestro, and in today's video, I'm going to be going over the North Stage 4's organ section. Recently, I obtained the North Stage 4 Compact. Um, I tried numerous different options before finally deciding on getting the North Stage 4 Compact. Um, if you want to know why I end up getting it in, getting the North Stage 4 Compact, I will be doing a uh, another video, pretty much an overview on my decisions and what led up to my decision in getting the North Stage 4 Compact. So we're going to go ahead and get into the video. For first starters, you see on the North Stage 4 organ, we now have faders. Um, this is also present on the organ, piano, and synth sections. Previously on the North Stage 3 and uh, stages before, prior, you had knobs. Now you have faders. Now they still operate just like the A and B panels on the North Stage 3, but instead they are presented here on faders. To activate these uh, the faders, you want to pretty much just press panel A or the panel B fader. If you would like to use both um, faders or to both panels, all you have to do is press both of them at the same time. If you would like to turn off one of the faders, simply press and hold the fader. On the North Stage 4, we have a few new features as well as certain features that are actually have been removed, which I'm hoping to get back on the North Stage 4. Uh, so Nord, if you're listening to this video or watching this video, these are there are a couple features that you guys uh, took off the North Stage 4 that would be um, beneficial to add back to the North Stage 4. As you see now, we also have the B3 base mode. Uh, many have said that this is a new feature. However, it is technically not a new feature. It is actually present on the Nord Electro 6D. It was later taken off, I believe, on the Stage 3 and is brought back on the Stage 4, which I'm pretty happy um, has been brought back because with the B3 base mode, if you connect your Nord Stage 4 uh, compact or any Nord Stage 4 via MIDI uh, pedal board, you can actually play pedal board, uh, you play your bass pedals like a true organ in conjunction with the North Stage 4, which I'm very happy about. You also see you have your vibrato and chorus section. These are technically the same still. Vibrato C2, V2, uh, sorry, C2, V3, C3, V2, C1, and V1. You also have your B3 percussion here that you can turn on and off. You also have your sustain pedal here, as well as your uh, P-stick. Another cool feature that has been added on not only just the organ section, but the piano and synth section now is that the octave shift buttons are located at the bottom of the sections of the keyboard. So your organ section, piano, and synth also have your octave shift as well as your keyboard zone buttons selection. So if I turn on the panel B of the organ, I can actually go to panel, panel A and say if I want to split panel B to panel A. I can just hit shift and we're at panel A and I can choose my keyboard zone selection here. Same thing with panel B. Okay. You also again you have your octave shift buttons here. So if you look at the screen here, you can see you can shift octave shift up an octave and shift down an octave one. Now for the B3 base mode, you can shift an octave ship up an octave one or ship shift down an octave one. Another cool thing with the North Stage 4 are the new LED draw bars. Now previously Nord used pretty much your actual mechanical draw bars which wasn't bad. Um, it was really good. But these new draw bars are a little bit more clicky which is great because you can actually feel a little bit more of the pretty much where you're positioning your draw bars. And it's pretty much just a cool new little visual uh, effects feature uh, with the Nord organ. Now, purposely for, pur purposely for me, I still do feel like they took a book out of Yamaha's, took a play out of Yamaha's book with the draw bars because, as you know, the Yawasi draw bars were LED as well, which is pretty cool that they incorporated it into the Nord Stage 4. On the North Stage 4, again, you still have your rotary speakers section here. You also have your drive here. Another cool thing that they added was your closed mic. So, excuse me, kick my camera. So your closed mic on the North Stage 4 pretty much emulates the mic position, pretty much micing the 
Leslie speaking for a wider sound. So if we actually try to play, let's see. So this is with the mic positioning off. And this is with the mic positioning on. So as you can hear, it may be subtle, but it's subtle enough that you can actually hear the difference. And for me, it actually kind of brings the sound of the Leslie up more in the forefront than it kind of sitting sitting back, if that makes sense. Another thing that they added was the angle. Uh, so pretty much this is going to deal with pretty much the positioning angle of the rotary horn when it stopped. Purposely, preferably for me, I don't really care for that too much. Um, so there are many musicians and organists who do care for that so that feature is available and you can just turn that on by hitting shift and sorry yeah hitting shift and there you go and you see here rotary stop angle back center back right back left front left front center or free and you also hit shift and turn it off as well you still have your slow and fast button down here and you have your preset organ buttons here now we're getting to the Nord organ settings. So if we hit shift and hit sound, we see here we have still have the key organ keyboard trigger, low and high. Um, the features that they actually took off the Nord, which I hope they bring back, are the rotor horn balance, the low key click level, and they also took away the Leslie options. So previously on the Nord Stage 3, you had the Leslie open and Leslie close option. And so they took that off of the North Stage 4, so I'm not too sure entirely as to what Leslie they chose with as a default. Um, but hopefully they bring that back um, on the North Stage 4, maybe in a later update. So you still have your Vintage 1 and Vintage 2 tone wheels to choose from. You also have your organ key click. Again, this is only now normal and high. Previously on the Stage 3, this was low, normal, and high. You do still have your low rotor, your rotor horn speed for low, high, and low, normal, and high. You have your rotor acceleration speed for low, normal, and high. And you also have your rotor horn acceleration for low, normal, and high. Now for me, I always keep my organ on Vintage 1. Sometimes I use it for Vintage 2 depending on the type of sound I'm going for. Uh, but other than that, that will be it for today's video on the Nord Stage for organs uh, section. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them in the comments section below and I'll get to them as soon as I can. If you're looking into getting the North Stage 4, you can get this at Zounds.com as well. Um, this is not a sponsored video. However, I will be apply, uh, be linking an affiliate link um, to the video. Um, you can purchase it without the affiliate link, but purchasing it through the affiliate link helps me out. Um, it also helps the uh, future of this YouTube channel as well. Nevertheless, thank you guys for watching this video. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them in the comment section below, and I'll get to them as soon as I can. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.